1891, and it is a vehicle. You can barely see the V on there. Just as I was talking about quarters. Man, silver quarter. Okay, folks, um, I just got a really, really good permission. Um, it's a like mid to late 1800s house. There was a house here. The original house was built back in, um, right after the Civil War. It was a Civil War soldier, actually. Um, apparently, it's been hunted out. There's nothing left, but I got permission. And very first target is a musket ball. That is awesome. Um, so I don't know the exact date of the house, but right after the Civil War is when the uh, original house came in, so mid-1860s, so there could be anything here. And I'm actually going to be doing, um, and that was only like half an inch down, I'm going to be doing um, like a shadow box for them and putting some stuff together and giving them a little display piece, so nice first very first signal and there's signals everywhere let me have you listen to it here apparently it's been hunted out there's still signals here there's a lot of iron too so I think we're gonna get some good stuff there's about like five acres here so let's get at it folks just got a beautiful signal in here I can see the rim of something Whew. okay it's a cow tag who I thought I had like a belt buckle or something first cow number 47 man that thing is thick I hit it mm. that makes me mad can display it on this side. Man, if there's signals like this still in here, there has got to be some good stuff. That thing is 92 all day. 88 to 92, you just don't miss, or just don't dig signals like that, especially something that was tight like this. Wow. Just dug a beautiful, beautiful little brass buckle. <clears throat> I don't know what that would be off of. Like a backpack or something. It's brass. Still works. I don't think there's any patent dates or numbers or anything on here. So I may not never know, but any ideas, please let me know. I have got a coin. See it green in there. Ah, it's a memorial. Uh, a very first year memorial, 1959. Holy cow. Could have been a wheat. Oh well though, that's beautiful green. 1959. We want older. Okay folks, I have a absolutely beautiful signal I want you to listen to. That is gorgeous. Gotta live dig that one. It's a little bit deeper. I found a few coins, but they've all been uh, modern on top of the surface. I said it was four inches. Oh, check that out. Coin, there's the mark. Memorial. 60s, 1967. Oh man. Oh well, there's got to be more out here. Got to be some older ones out here. Good sign though that there's still coins left. Okay folks, I just got a beautiful signal, nice and deep. It's way down in the bottom here, so right about six, seven inches. Just dug this up. That is old, old, old. Um, lantern part maybe? I guess that's what I'm thinking. Don't want to break it. Oh uh, yes, top to a lantern. Absolutely gorgeous. 
Man, I hit it again. Mm. Can't believe that. Beautiful lantern part. See the inside there. Nice. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's go get some more. Another hole. It was laying right there, it fell down to here. Oh, I don't know what this is. It's gorgeous, whatever it is. Let me give it a brush. Okay, I just brushed it up. That's what we have. There's no writing, no nothing on it. Could that be a... Uh, oh man, I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. No idea what it is. I'm definitely going to need some help on this one. Another beauty, beauty, beauty full signal. Let's listen to it here. Six inches. Now if that is not a coin signal, I don't know what it is. Definitely a coin signal. Could be something else though. Oh, I wish I had my wireless headphones back. Oh, how I miss them. Soil is extremely, extremely sandy, but it's holding together a bit. Okay, let's get down in there. Right up in here. Coin, coin, it's a weedy. Can already see it. I already see the weeds. Yep, absolutely, a weedy. One cent. Hopefully it's an early one. Not uh, 1950s. 1953D. Well, hey, Wheaties a start. Nice. I'm gonna need uh, probably the storm coil out in this field area because I am in a field. And if a 50s was six inches, I'm sure the uh, 1800s and teens are down a little bit lower. But that is a good sign. There's still coins here. Okay. Don't know about this one. Looks like it was gilted at one point. It's got a hole in that end. And a hole in the other. Nice 70, 69, 70 signal. Looks like there might be a design on it. Can't quite tell though. Thought it was going to be like a toe tap at first, but it's not. Let me know what you think. Picked out another good signal. Eighty, eighty-two, eighty-seven. It's a coin. It is a coin. Weedy. Weedy, weedy, weedy. Um, forties. 1941 D. No, 1947D. Weedy, oldest coin so far. 1947D. Alright, well there's still coins here, so I am excited. Get back at her. Got a nice hook. Got a hanging uh, plant hook or something. It's a beauty. It's an old one. Pop something round up. Ooh hoo hoo! It's a button! Um, it's one of the iron back ones. It's falling apart. Yeah, it's got an iron back and the shank is no longer there. So it's like turn of the century. That is a beautiful, beautiful little two piece button. And line's going down it. It's a big one, like a coat button, probably. Killer. Killer signal, 76.77. Sounded just like an Indian. Okay, well here is the roundup from the hunt. It was uh, an hour long. 
So there is obviously, and I've got a whole bag of trash here too. Tons of trash. Big, giant, screaming targets. A lot of copper and brass and all sorts of stuff. Um, here's the goodies. Got this. I don't know exactly what it is. I was thinking horse related at first, but now I'm not really sure. <laughs> uh, first signal of the day. Musket ball. That's cool. Um, and I found this thing with that coin. I'm not sure what it is, but I need to help on that one. Um, I think it's copper or brass. I think it's like a hose fitting. Copper, copper. This thing here, um, I was thinking maybe flashlight, but I really don't have the slightest idea. It's copper. Um, I'm going to need some help with that one. Uh, beautiful little hook. Uh, shell in there. I uh, can't get that out, but piece, I'm not sure what it is. Um, a lantern part. It's the top that actually would hang on a hook, like this. Walk your, uh, lantern around. Awesome. Uh, cow tag number 47. Got a beautiful little brass buckle. I'm not sure what that's off of or what it is, but awesome. And this beautiful little, like, coat button. Iron back, so it's probably 1900s. Um, down to some coins. I got a dime. Five uh, modern pennies. Uh, copper and four zinkins. And we had a 1967, a 1959, a 1953D, and a 1947D. So, not too bad. Oh, and a screwdriver. That was surface fine. Um, so, not too bad at all for an hour to go out and get this much in a supposedly hunted out, nothing left. They gritted the whole thing. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of targets there. I just focused on a little area and kind of cherry picked and got this. And I guarantee you there's probably like a year's worth of uh, metal detecting to be done there. So a lot of good stuff coming up. So I cannot wait. And this was just a test run for out for an hour. So I hope you enjoyed the hunt and I'll be back out again.